I've been drinking. I am back again with another look of the Havana Mambo twist and it's on me. Yes, the girl behind the camera that nobody gets to see when they watch those videos. I have the Havana Mambo twist in 12 inch from the Janet collection. I have five packs of the color 1B and I have two and a half packs of the color D blue. This hair is 12 inches. It's not the same length as the other one. Obviously the other one is 24 inches. The 12 inch for me stops right here in the front. In the back, I'm guessing right here. You guys can see that. But I actually like this length because it is very hot in Florida and I just had plaits in from a while ago. If you wanna go check that video out. I had plaits in for a while and it was so hot with those things. My back felt like it was on fire, literally. I bought this hair because I wanted, I didn't want my hair out at all. And I'm kind of like half natural, half perm, so you know how that goes. So you're probably like, okay, what's the twist? This is a twist. I made mine into a U part wig. U part wig. U part wig. What I mean by U part, I put it on a, I put it on a weaving cap that most people use for their crochet, you know, wigs. And I did that. And I was going to um, just do the front of it crochet, but I was like, nah, I don't want to do all of that. I don't, I like, I don't like going to sleep with a lot of hair on. So I was like, let me figure out if I can make it into a part. I crocheted it onto the cap, and then I left like a little section area so I can crochet the front in right here. So this part is the only part that's crocheted in. Everything else is on a cap. Here you won't see that it looks like a U part but I have a cap right here. There's a clip right here. I just pop that clip and I just take it out. So you see what I mean? There's like braids under here that I made. They're like really ugly right now. And I just go like that. And no, they don't hurt. I can promise you that. If they do feel uncomfortable, just move it. It's really not that hard. They all sit and wonder why Clips, these wig clips from a beauty supply So they were like two for a dollar Depending on where you go, they could be cheaper Or they might cost more So yeah Have them right here Right here, just a clip on my wig. I don't need to put it right here because, like I'm telling you, like the elastic really holds well onto the wig, so I'm really happy about that. This hair was $66. I bought this from the Beauty Depot. I believe at this moment they're the only ones who had the 12 inch, so I don't know. I just know when I bought it, they were the only ones who had it, so I was like, well, let me just get it right now because they sold out so fast. So if you guys can't find anywhere else, I would say head to the Beauty Depot right now. Like, and they're shipping depending on where you are from because they're in Jacksonville. If you're in Florida, shipping is like two days. So, which was awesome. I'm just so happy with my hair right now. I hope you guys love it. I hope you guys want to try it too. If you guys want to see the back. Yeah. Now, I did use eight packs because my head is big. I probably didn't have to use eight packs, but you know, better safe than sorry. Because, like I told you, they nobody else has this hair. So I would have been dumb. I would have been looking stupid like, oh my gosh, I only have seven packs. But I could have used seven though. But, you know, 
what does a girl do? She buys more hair. Also, I see a lot of people say how theirs unravel and you know, that discourages some people to, from getting it. If you see that people, theirs are unraveling, maybe you should ask them what are their daily routines because my clients, theirs never raveled. So, and they had it in for a long time. There's never raveled at all. And also if you see somebody and they say that theirs unraveled, just take some precautions when you they get yours. So maybe like burn the ends or seal the ends with water, but not too deep because if you do the ends will curl so just do some things maybe putting rubber bands at the end or clear rubber bands like that would be a new funky look you know like a new cool look to your Havana mama twist just do things that will help you out also I hope you guys remember that I am having a giveaway in my previous video I did talk about it because I am at 1,000 subscribers and I'm so happy about that so I'll be doing a giveaway don't forget to subscribe comment like and share this video Tell your friends, your your dad, your mom, your cousin, the girl you don't like, the guy you do like. Just tell everybody about this video. Uh.